So, just wanted to take a minute and give you guys an update. Um, so I'm fortunate enough to have a partner here. Oh, he's in the sun. There he is. This is my partner, Ron, and uh, he's been stranded here from Idaho. So he's just working on this plane every single day. Unfortunately, I am crazy busy at work and can't be down here a lot, but we'll just kind of give you an update of where we're at. We've been working on body work here with a lot of rough spots along there. We have been working on uh, filling in these wing areas right here. There was a hole there, and so we are got the first coat. Well, we actually put a piece of uh, fiberglass in here. It came down onto the uh, aileron. Then we filled it here. Now we just need to, looks like he's got it mostly sanded. We just need to refill that again, and looks like we need to sand the rest of them. Anyway, we showed you the tail on, but since then we've got all, all of the hydraulic lines ran, come up out of there along with the brakes, come across, fasten on there. Then we've got them tied on right there and zip tied up under the wing right there. And they are all hooked up and operational. Maybe if uh, I can talk Ron into it, he'll show you that in a minute. Been doing body work on the tail. We've got the rudder all in um, and hooked up and functional, which is nice. This is this side. We've got these wings done. I shown you last time we ran the wires through and got them out here so we can have some lights. And also, this is pretty exciting, we uh, uh, managed to round up this, which will be our power supply for the airplane. It's a Lycoming 320. Um, it is run out, but everything's there and in place. When I get a few minutes from work, hopefully soon, I'll be able to tear this down, get some stuff up to the machinist and get the parts gone through and get the new parts here. And we can um, get going on that and get it ready to go. So it looks like Ron's ready here to show us, but you can see now, I'll get where you can see the one main landing gear back here and the front landing gear here and he'll show. Well, I've got a fancy switch here. Real fancy switch. We like that. And then to go down. Then in here we've got these gauges. So you'll see that they're up to pressure. One of them's up to pressure. And then down. So that's fully operational, which is awesome. So our next thing we're going to do is get that back part right there behind the, the pylon uh, filled in. We've got most of the work done on our a uh, little wing section we're adding in this area right here to keep the spray from coming off up into the propeller. Um, we've got the cover right there. We actually have those made. They're sitting right here along with some of the parts for our little uh, uh, landing gear cover. And so we can get those on. There's our landing gear cover sides. We're going to start working on those. Anyway, that's the update. Thanks to Ron, it's moving along pretty good. If I can get caught up at work, then maybe we can really make some time. But it is starting to show that something's happening, which is exciting. So anyway, there we go. Until the next update, uh, 
Go ahead and subscribe and follow along on our project. And we also appreciate any comments or ideas you may have as we're not experts, so we appreciate input. Anyway, talk to you next time. Happy flying.